Okay, nandito na naman tayo sa next lesson para sa mga grade 6. Next module nila, yung division of decimals. Okay, so makinig, makinig mabuti para sa lesson dahan-dahan natin ipapaliwanag. Example number 1, diretso na tayo. Divide 34.75 divided by 5. Okay, dito dividing decimal by whole number. Okay, anong gagawin natin pag nagdi-divide tayo ng decimal by whole number? Divide as it is. You are dividing a whole number. Pero, yung point, lalagay mo na dun sa tapat niya. Para hindi ka na malito o mahirapan. Okay, lalagay mo na yun. So, yung first step. Then, i-divide na natin para tayo nagdi-divide lang ng whole number. So, una natin i-divide yung 34 divided by 5 is 6 times 5 is 30 Okay Tandaan na natin para maintindihan nyo Minus So, 4 minus 0 is 4 Bring down 7 Okay Then, di-divide natin ulit 47 divided by 5 is 9 9 times 5 is 45 Minus So, that is 2, bring down 5. Okay. Then, 25 divided by 5 is 5. 5 times 5 is 25. Then, minus 0. Okay. Naintindihan ba natin? Malinaw na malinaw. Okay. Okay. So, pag nagdi-divide tayo ng decimals by whole number, ang una natin gagawin is itapat lang natin yung point. Then, para lang tayo nagdi-divide ng whole number. 34 divided by 5 is 6. 6 times 5 is 30. Then, subtract. Bring down. Isa-isa lang yung bring down. 47 divided by 5 is 9. 9 times 5 is 45. Then, subtract. 2 isang bring down ulit, 25. And 25 divided by 5 is 5. So, 5 times 5, 25, 0. So, exact. So, ang sagot natin dito is 6.95. Okay? So, yan ang example natin for example number 1. Dividing decimal by whole number. Okay, punta tayo sa number 2. Yung number 2 is dividing decimal by a decimal. So, merong decimal din. Okay? Yung dividend natin, ito yung divisor. Yung divisor may decimal. Okay? So, anong ang gagawin natin pag may decimal? I-move natin yung decimal dun sa divisor para maging whole number. Okay? Then, okay, Bibilangin natin, 1. So, i-move din natin yung dividend ng isa. 1. Okay. So, ang mangyayari is 238 divided by 7. So, yun ang unang gagawin nyo. I-move nyo yung uh, decimal doon sa divisor. Okay, mag-move din kayo doon sa dividend. Kung ilan yung minob nyo dito, ganun din yung i-move nyo doon. Okay? So, then, i-divide na natin as dividing whole number. So, 23 divided by 7 is 3. 3 times 7 is 21. Then, subtract. 3 minus 1 is 2. Bring down 8. Then, 28 divided by 7 is 4. 4 times 7 is 28. Then, subtract is 0. So, ganyan pag magdi-divide ng decimal by a decimal. Okay, i-move natin yung divisor. Bilangin mo 1 para maging whole number. So, kung may point dito, i-move mo din yun ng isa. Okay, kung walang point, sir, tagdag ka ng 0. Pag gano'n, pag walang point. Kung ilang yung bilang ng move mo dito pag dalawa, dalawang zero pag walang point. Okay, so ganyan lang siya. 
ka simple okay kailangan pa natin ulitin so move natin ng isa move dito ng isa so maging yung 0.7 magiging 7 okay yung 23.8 magiging 238 na then divide okay so 23 divided by 7 is 3 3 times 7 is 21 then subtract so 2 bring down 8 Okay, so 20 divided by 7 is 4. Then 4 times 7, 20, 0 na siya. So ganyan lang siya. Kasimple, pag nag-divide para maging advance yung lesson ng grade 6. Sa susunod, mga grade 8 naman or grade 7, yung factoring, titignan natin yon. Kasi ito, hinahabol natin yung mga lesson para sa modular. Dahil, dahil sa pandemic. Okay. Next, number 3. Ngayon naman, divide 281.25 by 2.25. So, yung divisor natin na 2.25, meron na naman siyang decimal. Okay, so imumove natin. Bibilang tayo. 1, 2. So, dalawa. 1, 2. Okay. So, ano mangyayari? Magiging 2, 8, 1, 25 divided by 225. So, yung purpose natin dito, pag nag-divide, yung divisor natin, dapat full number siya. Kaya pag yung divisor natin may decimal, tatanggalin natin yung decimal. Kung ilan yung minog dito, ganun din yung imumove dun sa dividend natin. Naintindihan ba? Okay. So, pag wala na whole number ng divisor natin, i-divide na natin. So, 281, kung tatlo muna, divided by 225 is 1. 1 times 225 is 225. Okay. Then, subtract. Okay. Then, 11 minus, hiram tayo dito, magiging 7 na yan. 11 minus 5 is 6. 7 minus 2 is 5. Bring down 2. Okay? Then ito, didivide natin doon. So, ang sagot ay 2. 2 times 225 is 450. Okay? Then, subtract. Again, 2, 6 minus 5 is 1, 5 minus 4 is 1, bring down yung last, okay, bring down natin yung last, which is 5. Then, divide the last, 1,125 divided by 225 is 5. 5 times 225 is 1,125. So, pag minus mo yan, magiging zero na siya. Okay? So, our answer is 125. Nakuha ba natin? So, ganyan lang napakasimple. Kailangan i-move yung decimal doon. Kung ilan yung move mo, 1, 2. Dalawa din, 1, 2. Tapos, i-rewrite mo na para hindi ka malito. Then, divide as it is. Dividing whole number. Okay? Paano sir, pag walang point dito? Basta kung ilan yung bilang dito, yun ang idagdag mong zero doon. Pag walang point. So, ganyan yung lesson sa susunod na lesson ng mga grade 6. Shoutout muna tayo sa palaging sumusuporta sa ating channel, si Scenic Music in Motion. So, pa, pwede nyo siyang pasya lang si Scenic Music in Motion and maging kaibigan. So, tumutok lang dito sa matutol. Learn to love map. Till next time!